once was a man whose lifelong dream was to board a cruise ship and sail the Mediterranean Sea. He saved every penny until he had enough for his passage. He dreamed of walking the streets of Rome, Athens and Istanbul. Since money was tight, he brought an extra suitcase filled with cans of beans, boxes of crackers, and bags of powdered lemonade, and that is what he lived on every day. He would have loved to take part in the many activities offered on the ship. He envied those who went to movies, shows, and cultural presentations. And oh, how he yearned for only a taste of the amazing food he saw on the ship. But the man wanted to spend so very little money that he didn't participate in any of these. He was able to see the cities he had longed to visit, but for the most part of the journey, he stayed in his cabin and ate only his humble food. On the last day of the cruise, a crew member asked him which of the farewell parties he would be attending. It was then that the man learned that not only the farewell party, but almost everything on board the cruise ship, the food, the entertainment, all the activities had been included in the price of the ticket. Too late, the man realized that he had been living far beneath his privileges. We live beneath our privileges when we fail to partake of the feast of happiness, peace, and joy that God grants so bountifully. We can be satisfied with a diminished experience and settle for experiences far below our privileges, or we can partake of an abundant feast of spiritual opportunity and universal blessings. As you read the scriptures and listen to the words of the prophets with all your heart and mind, the Lord will tell you how to live up to your privileges. And we will be able to do all things through Christ who strengthens us.